The circus is in Hartford, and there are big changes after an accident injured several performers. What's being done to keep the show safe? Exfoliating your skin, but hurting the environment. The risks linked to those microbead scrubs. And a guarantee you'll get in to see your doctor. You know, right away, there's no waiting here. You, you, you come in, you have an appointment. Concierge medicine is giving patients 24-7 access to personalized care. But is it worth it? Live from WFSB, Connecticut's number one local news. This is Channel 3 Eyewitness News at 5. not in your health when you hear the word concierge you're probably thinking of someone in the hotel service business or a condominium or something like that but now there's a new twist to that word think concierge <laughs> medicine it's becoming more popular with people who want 24 7 access care to their doctor channel 3's irene o'connor shows us how your next trip to the doctor could be the change you are looking for like so many people these days, J.R. Clisham is super busy. He owns a self-storage facility business. He's always on the go and doesn't have a lot of time to sit in a waiting room. I can see my doctor, you know, right away. There's no waiting here. He now has a concierge doctor, and he's guaranteed to be seen on time. Doctors Paul Gardino and Thomas O'Connor own personal care physicians in Farmington. What people really are getting is, is accessibility, you know, when they need the physician. Whenever you need to talk to your doctor, you can talk to your doctor. And you always talk to your doctor, not to a nurse practitioner or something other than, than your doctor. Randall Bob was also looking for something different from his doctor. He now goes to Dr. Gardino, who met with him for over two hours in his first visit. I spent more time with, with my physician in those first two meetings than I probably did with my physician in the past 20 years. One of the major differences is that a lot of primary care doctors have thousands of patients, but these concierge doctors have 300 patients each, and they do make house calls. And then stayed in contact with them throughout the rest of the weekend, and thankfully they were able to get through it, get through it at the, in the comfort of their own home, and feel better, and get back to work on Monday. Insurance does cover the checkups and other visits, but for this kind of access and service with your doctor, the average cost for concierge is about $2,750 a year. Dr. Gardino predicts you're going to see more people turning to the concierge service in this new age of Obamacare. Many more people have access to health insurance. And what happens in that is that access goes down. It takes longer to get in to see a doctor. Uh, you may wait longer when you're at the doctor's. You may get, not get as long a visit as you need or would like. Dr. Gardino says with this kind of personal care, they can work on preventing health problems and avoid having patients go to the emergency room. In the end, he says that will save the system money. And for patients like Randall, it's peace of mind. With your health, Irene O'Connor, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Live. 